Hello, I'm Dr. Stanley Sandler, and I'd like to talk about violence. We, we tend to think that we in the Western world, at least, and that North America, Europe, Japan, so on, that we live in an age of violence. But I'm thinking, you know, go back to the 18th century. Every man who had any kind of uh, wealth at all uh, would, get, would go around armed. I'm thinking George Washington probably would, would ha carry a sword. When people went, again, people of some substance would go to a uh, downtown Paris or London or Berlin or whatever, they would uh, be armed and they'd also often have a man ahead of them, a, a young man, a burly young man with a, with a club to keep away the, the uh, cut purses and, and cut throats and that sort of thing. But you know, it really came home to me when I was looking at a, a book about a group of people in, in England who were reconstructing or building from scratch a wooden ship of the 18th century. Now, this is going to be just a merchant ship, like a packet ship, which would carry grain or rum or tobacco or whatever. And I noticed that as that ship was being built, they made four gun po ports on either side, which means that ship, a simple lowly merchantman, would carry eight guns. And I'm thinking, well, today, even with this day of piracy and so on, do any of our super tankers or anything carry weapons? No, they don't. But in this that age of, of, of this age of violence today, we we don't have that. So it just it kind of struck me that we, in a sense are living in a less violent age, even considering the wars and so on that, uh, that we had been through in the 20th century.